sometimes good cars fall into bad hands. And I'm here with Phil Glenister, the actor. Hello, Phil. Hi. You all right? Phil has curated this getaway car display. Do you want to take me for a quick tour? Come on in. Ah, oh, can you actually do a Michael Caine impression? This movie for the Italian job, which is what this Mini Cooper's from, it's going to be 50 years old next year. It's a hell of a great looking thing, isn't it? It's a beautiful, I love these spots as well. Yeah. And it's just a great, great British favourite, isn't it? Your character in Ashes to Ashes, Detective Gene Hunt. This yes. is your car, isn't it? Did you enjoy driving it? Invariably, I had £15,000 worth of camera equipment on the car. We were on such a tight schedule that we would be in the studio filming, doing the boring bit with all the lines. Yeah. And the stunt guys would be out throwing it around, making me look mum. Roger Moore. I think it was good. The very first episode of The Saint is called The Talented Husband. And this was the very car used in that very first episode. All here, we've got all the signatures wow. of a lot of people that worked on the show. There's dear Rog, look. He was a knitwear model, Roger Moore, who was an actor. And, and yeah. Michael Cade used to call him the big knit. <laughs> <laughs> Phil, thank you. I'm going to go and check out your other motors. Great, enjoy. Well, thanks a lot. An icon for 1990s rally, but also an icon for 1990s ram raiding. You'd see these being driven at speed by Colin McRae through the forests, and you'd also see them being driven at speed backwards through a shop window. This actual Mark I Lotus Cortina was the vehicle used in one of the most notorious robberies of all time, the great train robbery of 1963. This car was owned by the man that masterminded the plot. The irony was that those tires left imprints at the scene which ultimately helped the police to convict him. So you could say that the car grasped him up. The Range Rover, a car the preserve of the sort of people that enjoy a bit of hunting, fishing and shooting, sometimes the wrong kind of shooting. This was used in a number of cash machine robberies, the owner of which is currently behind bars. Although it is for sale. Don't have nightmares, folks. Thanks for watching. <laughs>